Dehus in Andel has opted for the construction of a new grinding mixing line that meets the highest requirements in terms of accuracy and contamination in order to optimally produce their specialized compound feed. After considering various scenarios, from new construction to modernization, the choice was made to realize this line in the existing building. It was important that the deliveries to customers could continue normally. This meant that the production could only be interrupted minimally. Based on good experiences from the past, De Hus and Andel preferred to execute this project with Van Arsen. In consultation with Van Arsen, a solution has been developed in which the downtime is limited to three times two days. The shutdown of the production was necessary for the exchange of elevators and the connection of the existing line with the new line, including startup and testing. In order to realize the optimal layout of the new grinding mixing line with minimal vertical transport, the existing building has been raised. The machines are installed in a new steel structure that is installed within the existing building. They were mounted layer by layer and lifted into the new construction via the roof. The construction of the line has been carried out in two phases. First, the column was placed with the mixer and the fine dosing system. Then, a second column with the Van Arsen GD hammer mill was realized. During the construction, there was a continuous dialogue between De Hus and Van Arsen to fine-tune the building process, such as the deployment of cranes. How does it work? After arrival, the grains and minerals are weighed into the existing dosing wares and transported to the hammer mill by the new raw material elevator. In the Van Arsen hammer mill, the raw materials are ground into a fine grind. With the automatic screen change, the Hughes can quickly switch between three different screen sizes. In combination with the frequency-controlled motor, the highest flexibility and accuracy is achieved in particle size and grinding structure. Optimal quality in combination with a high capacity. Micro-ingredients are weighed and dosed by the new Van Arsen Small Ingredients Dosing Units. Both units are fitted with two extra dosing screws to enable the dosing of 20 different micro components in total. This system has been executed as a closed process in order to prevent loss or contamination of raw materials. The product cells for difficult flowing ingredients are equipped with a stirring device. Because accuracy and minimization of contamination is of great importance for the precious micro ingredients, these dosing units are placed directly above the mixer. The powdered micro-ingredients are directly applied to the mixer and do not have to be ground first. If desired, additional components can be added manually. In the paddle mixer, all ingredients are mixed into a homogeneous mixture. Contamination is kept to a minimum by the large bomb doors that open up to under the head plates at a 60 degree angle. Beaters on the bomb doors ensure a complete emptying of the mixer. From the mixer, the compound is transported by contamination poor transports to the existing pelletine line and next leaves the factory as high quality feed. The new mixing line for De Hus and Andel is once again proof of a Van Arsen project that offers maximum added value. The line offers the Hus and Andel the opportunity to produce a high constant feed quality by means of optimum grinding results, a high dosing accuracy, and minimal contamination in the production process. For the Hus and Andel, Van Arsen was the vital link in the construction of this grinding mixing line.